just going to stick this to my nipple. I'm going to teach you how to play Punisher by Phoebe Bridges, except it's going to be a little bit different. Um, we're going to play it in A. She plays it in a different key. I don't know what that is. Um, and we're going to just do the really simple version and not do the boring bits. So if you're lazy, this is the thing for you. Um, you'll need one of these. Just pop it on the second one. Oop. And we're going to be using G chords. So G, C, D, that's pretty much it. If you have a higher voice, feel free to sing this like the octave up. Or if this is too low for you, just step this bad boy up a few steps. Uh, if it's too high for you, you know, you can take it off, just play it in G, or you can use C chords or whatever. Uh, that's up to you. I have played this song before, so I'll put a link somewhere. Um, if you want to listen to it, you don't have to. I'm not your mum. I'll go through the chords that you need. So pretty much all you need is G, C and D. So. G, brilliant, D is the next one, so I play it like this, this is an F sharp, this is just a normal D, I mean G, like leave these two fingers exactly how you would play a G, and then just put that there, you can play it like this, I just think it sounds a little bit country, so not a big fan, I just play it like this, and then C, everyone knows how to play C. Uh, but I play it's the G on C instead of this C. So pretty much these fingers, these bottom two fingers, don't move throughout the whole song, just... Brilliant. There's also some finger picking if you'd like, so... Uh, you don't have to do that, you can just literally... which is probably going to be the easiest way to do this if you're learning. Um, so just do that, uh, or don't do that, do whatever you want. Um, but important to note that in the verse, uh, the C is held for an extra bar, so it's pretty much instead of being G, D, C, it's G, D, C, and then imagine playing another C, but just not playing anything, just holding it. So. Um, So I'll play the first bit of the first verse because um, the whole verse is the same, so I won't play the whole thing. Um, just to give you an idea of how it goes, uh, again, I'll be playing it lower than normal, but you know, bear with me. When the speed kicks in. I go to the store for nothing and walk right by the house where you lived with Snow White. All right, so yep, that's pretty much how it goes the whole song. So um, there's a bit of an anacrusis when the first bit of the song starts, so an, an, an anacrusis is a couple of notes before the actual chord, um, the start of the song effectively. Um, think, uh, I don't know, if you're American, which you probably are because you're watching this, song, this video, um, uh, in your national anthem it goes, oh, say, can you blah, blah, blah. That's the anacrusis, is the oh. Uh, and then the song starts, but um, pretty sure that's the American National Anthem. It might not be, I don't know. Um, yeah, so when the speed, that's the start of the song really, is the, the chord on uh, the G on speed, but whatever. So I'll play the timing for you. So when the speed kicks in. I go to the store for nothing and walk right by the house where you lived with Snow White. 
I wonder if she ever thought the storybook tiles on the roof were too much. But from the window, it's not a bad show. If your favorite things, Dianetics or Stucco. So that, that obviously a lot of anacrusis there, the storybook tiles, so it's on tiles. So there's four syllables before you play the chord. So just keep that in mind. It's a bit hard to get the vibe of it, um, but you got this, I believe in you. Um, so the next bit is, the drug stores are open all night. She goes high there. The only real reason I moved to the east side. I love a good place to hide in plain sight. So these chords that I will probably link you don't have the D, but there's a D there. Place to hide or the F sharp, whatever you, however you want to play it. First done. Well done. Good job. Thanks for staying with me. So the next bit is fortunately uh, pretty easy. This is the chorus. Um, it, it yeah has an E minor. Didn't tell you about it. Sorry. Everyone knows how to play an E minor. That's an E minor. You can leave those two fingers there as well if you want. That's what I'm going to be doing because I'm lazy and I don't like moving these two fingers because they suck. So I'll play it once and then I'll do it really slowly to just show you how it goes. So. What if I told you I feel like I know you But we never met And then you go, nee, 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 and then you verse, whatever So pretty much you hold the G What if I told you C I feel like I know you, E minor, but we never met. And then you hold the C a couple bars. Then there's a huge anacrusis. It goes, and hear everyone. So five syllables, knows. So we'll get to that. So, and here everyone knows you're the way to my heart. Here's so many stories of you at the bar. Most times alone and some looking your worst, but never not sweet to the trust funds and punishes. So a lot of the chords here for some reason don't have the right chords. Um, it's literally the same as the first verse. So G, D, C. Here, for example, it just says G, but it goes, and here everyone knows you're the way to my heart. So three chords in there, only says there's one. I didn't write them, but do what you want. So I guess from the top, I'll just play the chords and you can fill them in in your brain. And here everyone knows you're the way to my heart. Here's so many stories of you at the bar. Most times alone and some looking at your worst, but never not sweet to the trust funds and punishes. Man, I wish that I could say the same. Could is when you play the chord. I swear I'm not angry, that's just my face. A copycat killer with a chemical cut. Either I'm careless or I want to get caught. Same chords again, it's not there. Um, anyways, then we play the chorus again. We've gone over this, so I won't be doing that again. Um, if you'd like to just rewind or do whatever you want, um, it's a great song. Uh, I hope you learnt something. Thanks for listening. Uh, I have a Patreon if you want to uh, support me do more of these. Um, I'm still learning how to do these tutorial things. I'm not that patient, so sometimes they're a bit rushed. Sorry about that. Um, I also have another job, so this is the reason that that is why this be. I'd just like to thank you for listening, and I will see you next time.